Godfrey was finally cast out into the dark, or Bongo Bongo Land, as he probably calls it. There was this programme called Broken Bad, sort of like a chemistry programme, but with acting in it to keep the science interesting. It was really good, like really atmospheric, and it was presented by this bloke who was sort of clever, but like a bit ill, like I think he had a cold or something. <coughs> Sometimes he'd be coughing and you'd think, shouldn't they just wait to film this when he's better? It was a bit like Top Gear, but for drugs. And so he was like Jeremy Clarkson, and he had this funny little sidekick who was like his Richard Hammond, but who got all depressed because of some relationship problem or something, where his girlfriend got a stomach bug and then just lay around in bed. The main block kept making crystals, a bit like my auntie who had this shop in Stafford selling crystals and dream catchers and things. But he made loads of money out of it, whereas my auntie had to close a shop in 2009 because it never really caught on. He was mental with his presenter. Like, you never knew what he was going to do next, you know. Like, one minute, he'd be running around in his pants, and then he'd cut all his hair off. Or, like, turn up in a sort of silly hat. Or, like, sort of plastic dungarees. It was proper bonkers. Like Chris Evans used to be on a big breakfast. You had to watch it, because everyone was watching it. So, if you weren't watching it, people who were watching it kept saying, Are you watching it? And you'd have to say, No, I'm not watching it. But you'd think, I should be watching it. So then you'd start watching it and then you'd be like, why am I watching this? Because for a chemistry show, it's really sad. What was weird was it wasn't on real television. Like, you had to watch it on this sort of computer television thing. But it was really well done, like, better than it used to be. Like, when they used to use computers to do the telly in the old days, like, in that entertaining Die Straits music video thing, if you look closely, you could sort of tell it wasn't real because they weren't quite right, like, their knees weren't quite right. But in Breaking Bad, it was so well done, you'd never think it was all computer people at all. Like, their knees were spot on. It was amazing. Thing is, everyone said it was brilliant and the best programme ever. But it can't be that good because it finished and apparently it's never coming back. Help me, I'm Amanda Berry.